Hi, uh, I'm Carmelo Cortez. Uh, I belong to to the Diocese of Malolos, Bulacan, Philippines. Um, I'm married to my wife, Rosita Cortez, and I have family. I'm a lay person serving to the Diocese of Malolos as member of Commission of Liturgies. And also, uh, I was involved in the healing ministry through the Mother of the Eucharist and Grace. Uh, can you explain the importance of the name Mother of the Eucharist and Grace? The Mother of the Eucharist and Grace began in 1991 when the Blessed Virgin Mary gave her my manifestation. One of the lawyer gave it to me a pictures of the Blessed Virgin Mary. That picture was originally was painted by Saint Luke the Evangelist and give it to Saint Thomas and bring to the India. The first the picture was developed in the uh, Philippines, give it to me by the lawyer. The name is Ramon Attorney Pedrosa uh, on June 11. I don't want to accept this picture, but I kept the picture now. At the 3 o'clock in the morning, I can hear different kinds of music. Uh, I cannot find out where the music came, but I found the music where the picture I kept on June 11 in 1991. So, 3 o'clock in the morning on June 12, that picture become tridimensional and the Blessed Virgin Mary crying and the baby Jesus tried to catch in the blood from the, from the eyes of the Blessed Virgin Mary. That picture become tridimensional. At this time, I don't know what is the meaning of this. So I called the priest, is the name Padre Virgilio Bartolome as Lidi. And the Padre Bart, the time is cancer of the skin. Cancer of the skin is better, a little bit past this. So I call the priest. First, I don't know what kind of this manifestation. And the priest, Padre Bart, the time is very sickness. And uh, he uh, also, to the doctor, give him to live two weeks or one month. And and I asked him to pray, and Father Bart pray also and venerate the statues, uh, the, the the images of the pictures of the Blessed Virgin Mary. And after so many years, Father died. Father Bart, Father Virgilio Bartolome SPD died last August 5, 2015, almost 25 years. So he died in, not in the skin, but in another kind of sickness and become my spiritual director. And Father Bart told me, go to retreat. At the three o'clock in the morning, I can see a wonderful signs of manifestations of the Blessed Virgin Mary. She stand at my bed. She, she a white, bright light. And his post heart, the center of the heart, is surrounded by the 12 star. And a bright light in the heart, his post heart. The right hands of the, ros of the, of the Blessed Virgin Rosal Rosary, and the left the scapular. Her message is back to the Roman Catholic Church receiving the body and blood of her son Jesus Christ in the Eucharist, practicing the sacrament of reconciliation, pray for the priest, and pray for the church. And uh, fasting and build the house of prayer. I told her name, I'm the mother of the Eucharist and Grace. The ministry of the mother of Eucharist and Grace, we, we are uh, forming our foundations and prayer groups. First, the family, we're starting the promoting the importance of the Eucharist, and we are promoting the importance of promoting the sacrament of compassion, of the reconciliation, and pray for the priest and pray for the church. And the one of the important in our time, in, in the struggle of our time, the church during, in our time, in our generation, so the struggle, we are the part of the church. The church is not only uh, by the structural, we are the part of the church. We call our part as church of church militant. We pray for the priest and pray for the church. And this is very important for us. 
to pray for the church because we are baptized and always we ask the priest to pray for to, to our loved ones who seek uh, to bless our religious article and perform uh, uh, the ministry, the sacrament of Eucharist, the wedding, the compassion, and the holy order by the bishop, the pulpits of the priesthood of Christ. And the most important to us, the, not only part of the church, but continue to pray for each other and also for our church because Pope John Paul the Great, the Saint John Paul the Great said, the family is the small church. We are, every Sunday, we are obligated to go to our mother church. This is the we call congregation, that's mother church, that we are support. And also, the mother of Eucharist is starting promoting the importance of sacramental reconciliation, like, uh, because it's very important. Reconciliation is, uh, is a grace of God. Every priest give it to you uh, absolution. You receive a grace of God. And, Saint Pete, and our Lord to St. Peter, they promise, if you cannot unlock the key, you cannot forgive in this earth, I cannot forgive in heaven. So Peter, our first pope, our successor pope is uh, now is Pope Francis, is reminder us is the Pope of Mercy. We call that Pope Pope Francis said the year this coming December eight, few few days ago. And now the starting year of Mercy on December eight is the Mercy, the grace of God is very important. And the Pope Francis said, uh, this is the mercy door and year of mercy is a time to call the church is not church of punishment. It's not church of priests, but this is a church of the poor. And not only the church of the poor, this is the church of mercy. Mercy to the love of the people, especially the faithful, the Catholic or not Catholic, you're the church, you are, you are part of the of God's salvation for everybody. Even you're not Catholic, you're Catholic, and even your different religion belief. The most important, this is the church, the door will be open. Even you're not Catholic, Catholic. And Pope Francis insists to every Catholic to go to, to renew our vow of baptism. And also, not only for renew, but also to go to compassion, the most important is the compassion, uh, especially the Pope give the authority to the priest to, to absolve and give uh, absolution those or people, uh, those are getting reserved sin. What is reserved sin is committing abortion. So if you go to priest during the time, the priest cannot give absolution to to committing abortion. You need to go to bishop, and sometimes the bishop give only two uh, faculty to the priest to absolve the the woman who perform uh, abortion. But now, in the year of mercy, is everybody the all the reserved sin to remind us the love of God is very important. The love of God is the mercy of God. And the mercy of God is the face of Jesus, the face of God. And the church is not a punishment church. This is a fatherly approach to the faithful, to everyone. That's a reminder of our Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of the Eucharist, the sacrament. Uh, this was a question from my teacher. He asked, uh, why do some people get healed and other people don't get healed? Uh, yes. Uh, many people, they heal. There, there are so many people not healed. It's a good question. All the, all the patients to go to the hospital, hospital, do you think that person to go to the hospital, they get well or, that, or not getting well? That's the answer. If it is, this is the mother of faith. 
in the last minute of the difference between the the medical term if you are go to spiritually if you go to hospital you're preparing uh, preparing uh, we call you give medical attention your physical but this is temporary physical aspect of our elements of our body if we are dying it's better to prepare if you go to, to our Lord Jesus to, 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 to the religious or prayer you prepare both physical emotional to heal if you die you prepare yourself not only prepare yourself the healing is not the physical healing but the the healing is the speak most of them the spiritual healing and also the healing of every family if you are prepared to die by the prayer and, and your family a little bit to accept if you are very close to God it, that, the meaning of the healing that we are not amazed if some people attend to the healing service that heal or the heal we are not amazed we are always amazed is the healing is the conversion of the heart of every person even you go to even you go to 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 the doctors if you don't believe you are not healed you are not healed but if you go to the healing service if you don't believe that's your that's your faith it's a matter of faith faith is very important in the last minute of our life is the faith is our hope to bring to our Lord Jesus Christ. But what should she do with the rose petal, with the image? Uh, sometimes, uh, talk to the people, don't amaze to the petals, what, what, uh, do, what is the best in the petals. The most important is, what is connection of your petals to be converted, to be close to God? and to the serve to the poor people. Okay. Uh, and then, do you know why when you first saw Our Lady that she was crying? Uh, this, the, like I said, that the Blessed Virgin Mary asking to pray, especially the eruption of Pinatubo in the Philippines and disaster happened in the Philippines after the eruption of Pinatubo on June... 14, 2000, uh, 1991. Uh, are there any messages that you or Our Lady want to give to the world right now? The, the most important is for us is the Blessed Virgin Mary appear all over the world. Not only appear to me, not all, only appear to everybody. She appear every of us to remind us she's the mother of Jesus. And this our privilege, a privilege the teaching of the church, believe or you're not to the private revelation or not, you are not committing mortal sin. It's better to believe because Pope Francis said, if you don't believe to the Mary is a mother of Jesus, you are like orphans, no mother. So it's better to believe to remind us to be close, to believe as long there's no error or against the teachings of our doctrines, of our faith to the Catholic Church. And the most important, the apparitions and revelations to remind us to be close is a sacramentals. It's not a sacrament. And every sacramentals, if you saw a mess if you hear the message and you experience the wonderful signs of the blessed virgin mary is very to be close to our lord jesus christ this is, is a very important to be close not only to our lord jesus christ to be close to the poor people and to be close to the people especially the homeless the sickness people in the prison people and People that bought it, you are part of this mission of our Lord Jesus Christ. Because what do it to your to other is do it to our Lord Jesus Christ. 
itatagalugin ko. Kung ano mang ginawa mo sa maliit mong kapatid, ay ginawa mo sa Panginoon. At ano mang ginawa mo sa Panginoon, ay ginawa mo rin sa iyong kapatid na nagihirap. Uh, and you're very involved with the ministry of helping the poor in the Philippines. Uh, what suggestions do you have for people who want to help? Ah, uh, definitely, if you want to help to the to the poor in the Philippines, not only the Philippines, all over the world, don't give your donation to any institution or especially the government in the Philippines direct if you are really servant of God if you want to help to the poor go out bring your goods and give personally to the people who need it especially the poor because it's, there's different I give my money and buy the food and different you go there and buy the food and give personally to appreciation and the most of that the meaning of compassion and people knows you serve because in the name of god it's not in the name of the politics or to be to be a politicians like mother teresa mother teresa received a donation and also mother teresa said Better to go there, food, uh, soup kitchen for the poor. And personally, and your family or your loved one, those in charge to serve the people. You cannot, you cannot uh, go there. Uh, how we should support the Pope in his mission? Uh, the Holy Father, Pope Francis. We're talking Pope Francis. Uh, the mission of Pope Francis is one is in every baptized Catholic, we are obligated to evangelize to the people of the people. Not only the evangelize, the Pope said is feed them. Because you cannot evangelize people if there's people not, you cannot evangelize people if the people hunger so you need feed so did you feed people is the one way of the evangelization to close to God remember every time you do good to other that's that's God you bring the sh the pace of God to everybody I want to share the one the story of the blind woman the one, the one lady, who, the young lady woman, she, she birth, since birth, she's blind. And she street vendors in the street in New York City. She's selling apple. And, you know, New York City is very walking past this. And everybody approaches that woman, that lady, uh, small lady woman to buy the apple but she ignored that but there's a, a, a man he need to pass this to because he almost he laid to the airport and he walked past this and he is that accidentally accidentally he 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 uh, he uh, touched to the to the uh, the store or the stall the stall of the apple of the uh, all the apple will throw out to the to the street and the man is instead to hurry up to airport to put to pick up all the apples and they give a little money how much the damage. And when the lady, the young lady told to the, to the mother, mother and my father, I know, even I cannot see the face of God, I heard and see the face of God because of this man. Do good job 
to the other person. Forgiveness is very hard because forgiveness is very hard. Forgiveness is a grace of God. It just better it translate in Tagalog ang pagpapatawad ay mula sa puso. Ito'y grasya ng Diyos. Huwag tayong madamot. Ang taong madamot, madaling mamatay. Ang taong madamot, ayaw magmahal. Ang taong madamot, ayaw niyang ibigay ko anong meron siya. Gusto niya lang sa kanya. Kung ibabahagi mo ang biyaya ng Diyos sa kapwa mo, walang madamot, siguro walang naghihirap sa mundo natin ito. Kasi ayaw natin magbigay kasi lolokohin tayo. Ayaw natin tumulong kasi madedengoy tayo. The most important, show the love of God and the mercy of God. Si Kristo, binigay niya yung buhay niya. Naniniwala siya kasi hindi siya natatakot mamatay. He's God's that afraid to die because to show His love. Even us, don't be afraid to die because of love. To show, to share our life to other people. Uh, any last words that you want? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Davy. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy New Year, Rami. Okay. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And for most important, uh, to me, I always ask to the people, pray for me. The meaningful of to embrace the Holy Father of Pope Francis. One of my favorite saints is Pope Francis. Uh, St. Francis of Assisi. You know, the meaning of embracing Pope Francis, not only to be a legacy, is that for popularity, is that for big star. To embrace Pope Francis, you need to embrace a poor people and evangelize them to the help and feed them and food, soup kitchen for the poor people is very important because if you love God, if some people to reflection the light eyes of God, 100% God always with us. God never abandoned us. God never abandoned us despite of all our problem because his promise in the Lord I'm the Emmanuel the meaning of Emmanuel I'm always be with you pray for me okay, thank you okay. what more here here Look at first. Ano na? Ano ko lang is? Sometimes the image not appear, but you pray. You pray that. Better to go outside for to clear up. Uh, can you tell 
us which ones. Uh, which this one Jan Paul II. Okay. Okay. This Jesus. You see that? This is Jan Paul II. This is Saint Francis. And this is Saint Michael. Oh, can you show Saint Michael again? <laughs> okay. Those uh those are people sometimes we are misconception about the uh, blaming to our brothers and Jewish brothers some Catholic or some people blaming you you kill Jesus but the most important is uh, uh, the salvation of God don't blame even sometimes there's a rule sometimes uh it's hard to explain uh the most important we love us to each other even our different beliefs and the most important uh respect what is the belief of other and the gold follow the golden rules and um, to the Jewish peoples always the Christians people blaming you kill Christ but the most important not Jewish people that killed the Christ the most important according to to the scripture the most important is uh, to love to uh, Christ uh, die for us not uh, you're not killers of Christ is to everybody is the most important that Christ dies for us but different way in the crucifixions or whatever the most important 2,000 years is the most important is forgiveness and uh, as Catholic I, I want to thank you to the Jewish people because if there is no if there's no Jewish people to suffer Christ and crucify Christ and God cannot fulfill the meaning of the the love of God and to show to everybody the meaning of the salvation to everybody you are not the killers of Christ you are uh, uh, the most important is to to become to be a witness of not only for the crucify of Christ and die blaming Christ of God Jesus Christ the most important is is Jesus will be resurrected in your place and many of them witness is the Jew the ascension of our Lord Jesus Christ even where different way of belief the most important we believe in God we believe in in there's a creation those are atheists or not believing God uh, I want I only I say I love you that's that's my words and God love us even different way of you are not believing God and I know your heart there's God in your heart in your heart even you cannot show your your belief to other the atheist hated God the most important we respect what is belief of other people 
believe in God, or not believe in God, the most important, follow the golden rules. This is a biblical, this is a human rules, and the, the, in, we meet in halfway to, to, to show the love of you, meaning of humanity to each other. That's my words. I, I read the books, oh, okay. but I remind everybody, exorcism, the lay person like me, I not allow only the designated by the bishop to perform, perform the exorcism uh, authority by the authority of the bishop to the priest. Every diocese there's assignment assigned to perform the exorcism. A lay person, I think the lay person only a deliverance and prayer. Yeah. But uh, like for those who are under attack, do you have any advice for them? The under attack is first is uh, sometimes we encounter. Sometimes I encounter uh, a student, 50 students, they suffer of, uh, suffer uh, uh, kinds of the, um, in the Philippines, they suffer a uh, light uh, attitude of light, uh, powerful, strong, we can control. But, we if there's where there's a way my prayer of deliverance prayer if the person if the person is under attack of the devil is under process sorry under process of the devil if it if filipino he understand he understand english and the filipino so i pray Chinese prayer. I pray Mandarin prayer. So that 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 pro possessed people cannot understand my language. And I'm sure if understand the Chinese words Mandarin and the words of Chinese, my prayer in our father in Mandarin and Japanese in Mandarin, other language, if if that person under uh, possess of the devil, he understand my prayer. I'm sure he need a priest. If that understand, it's better to go to restaurant and to eat. Uh, to eat? Why? <laughs> to eat. Because sometimes, if you're empty stomach, sometimes <laughs> you are you are a little bit uh. A little bit sometimes in going to your mind. Oh, too hungry. <laughs> hungry. I, that's your set, not me. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's, the, that's my... Uh, secondly, um, my advice to the people, uh, don't entertain in your home. Number one is in your home, if you don't want to entertain a devil, don't allow... Put your soul, your pornography picture. Pornography picture, X-rated video, X-rated pictures, or any kinds of the uh, uh, evil force you entertain in that you enter like that, you enter uh, the different way of kinds of evil in our home throw it and throw all the kinds of the uh, throw all of kinds of the kinds of books about the devils comics of the devils picture of the devils and throw it because sometimes they're psychological that's my uh, Is there any, how about for the, the Buddhists and the Hindus, um, what should we, 
the, 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 remember, the sunlight is not only the sunlight not only to for the Catholic, the sunlight for everybody. Christ dies not for only for the Christian or the Catholic, but for everybody, like sun. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ and St. Francis of Assisi. This is the Eucharist. This is the Last Supper. to get it <laughs> yeah, yeah you asked me about the purgatory uh like i said we are three parts of the church the catholic church there's a three part one there are three parts of the catholic church the first church is a uh, church triumphum there's saint in heaven the oh the die declared by the church and then declared the church the other one is the church suffering. The church suffering, those who die, uh, prepare, but we need to uh, a little bit purify the soul we call a purgatory. That's the teaching of our Catholic Church. Yan ang turo ng ating simbahan, may purgatory. Hinahanda tayo upang lalo tayo maging banal maging banal sa harapan ng Panginoon. At higit sa lahat, kahit dito ang Panginoon sa lupa ay bumapa, ay siya ay niramay niya tayo, pumunta siya dito sa lupa, hindi para sa mga mabubuti. Mabubuti. There's different holy at mabubuti. Banal at hindi at hindi mabuti. Pumunta siya, siya dito para sa mga makasalanan. So, binigay niya ang kanyang buhay dito sa ibabo ng mundo para magkaroon tayo ng kaligtasan and ang Diyos ay mapagmahal at merciful. Kaya hinandog niya ang isang lugar na lalagyan natin na tinatawag nating Purgatory. That's the belief of Catholic Church. That's not only beliefs. That that's dogma. Na pinaniniwala natin to prepare to our soul to face 
to God. Kasi tayo ay makasalanan, tayo ay nagkasala, tayo nagkaroon ng mga original sins. So, hinahanda tayo upang sa mas magandang patutunguhan natin sa pinangako ng Diyos. Katulad ng kung ikaw, kung ikaw ay ililipat sa isang bagong bahay na new house, ang una mong gagawin ay lilitisin mo yung bahay, pupunasan mo, aayusin mo. And after maayos mo yung bahay, malinis, hahakutin mo yung gamit mo at ready ka na tumira sa tahanan na iyong uh, pinagawa o titiran. That's it. 